Hey Bold fans, how's everybody doing? I know I haven't been doing a lot of commentary videos. But I just had to come on and do a rant about all the stuff going on on the Bold and the Beautiful. Stay tuned, we got lots to talk about. You don't want to miss this. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and check out my channel merch, now available. Yes. Yes, I do. Okay, so first off, what the hell is Rich thinking? On the same day, he serves his wife with annulment papers. Didn't expect to see you, Carter. Yeah, uh, Rich asked me to come. Oh, I see. You have something for me. I do. He proposes to his ex-wife. Um, Rich, I think. One thing this tells me is that he is definitely not divorcing Brooke for the right reasons. Brooke, why would you agree to that? What was I going to do, Donna? Rich wants an annulment. But you don't. No, of course I don't. It broke my heart. But I'm not going to just stand in his way if that's really what he wants. Oh. Obviously, it's just because he wants to be with Taylor. And speaking of Taylor. Excited for her. I want her to be here. Yeah. Okay, what's Mom, going on? Hey, I got your text. This woman is a professional psychiatrist. How is she going to fall for a guy on the rebound for one day? So what's going on? Come on, I had to reschedule a patient. Well, I think you're going to want the rest of the day off to celebrate after you hear this incredible news. Well, for you and Dad, yeah. not, not so much for Brooke. What are you talking about? And knowing all the history, knowing how he always goes back to Brooke, you want to just wipe away all of the memories that we've ever had. That's impossible. I remember every moment I spent with you. Well, it's not the end, Ridge. It's not. Know that we've both done things and we've forgiven each other for that. We've moved The past damage it. has been done. You see that? What damage? I don't get it. What is it? What is it that is making you want to end our marriage? She's just willing to throw herself in the hole and hope somebody can dig her out later because she knows what's coming. And that's if we didn't have this new discovery where Douglas finds the recordings on his phone that Thomas tried to delete. Well, you know, Douglas is getting bigger now and a real smart boy he is because he figured all of this out, put two and two together. What's with the guilty look? You deleted the app, like I said, right? I started to. And he realizes his father is a liar. He has deceived everyone again. But I wanted to hear the recordings just one last time. Recordings? I mean, you said they were all lost in some kind of glitch. Turns out you can score them. I doubt that. You know, I, I don't think Donna really knows what she's talking about. You can. It's super easy. Well, you did it? You got all the files back? Yep. Got all of them back. All of mine. Even some others. Others. As he said on the episode, he feels like this is like baby Beth all over again. No, I was talking about you. What you did was wrong. Reminds me of when we found out baby Beth was alive. He kept it from everyone. One word from you about my sister's daughter, Phoebe. And you'll lose more than your boyfriend or your job. Yours is the only name mentioned all over Phoebe's bogus adoption papers. Her name is Beth. Does that make you feel better saying it out loud? Phoebe's Beth, Beth is Phoebe. Okay, well, no one is going to know that baby Beth is alive. Understood? I gotta go. Douglas. And although I told you Thomas about denies it. Sorry. It's not the same, Douglas. It is the same thing. Yo, what's up? Why did you say that baby Beth is alive? I didn't. I heard you. No, you, you misheard. You said it on the phone. It's I manipulation. It's deception. And it's not going to end the same either. And it's what Thomas does. I won't be revealing Phoebe's true identity, not to Steffi or to Hope. And neither will you. Not a word. Not ever. You're gonna keep your mouth shut. 
You're to keep this secret until the day you die. She's back. No. She is. That's Phoebe. Phoebe is Beth. That's awesome. Beth didn't die. She's alive. That's your baby. That's Beth. Probably because that's all he's ever been taught. I need to open the damn door. Don't listen to him. Don't ever listen to him again. Thomas knew. About Phoebe. Not about Phoebe. About Beth. Her daughter never died. Hope oh, she's alive. He's watched his dad do it for years with Brooke and Taylor going back and forth using whoever is comfortable at the moment. So that's what Steffi and Thomas have learned their whole lives. Just whatever you have to do to get what you what want. Is the karma is on the horizon. Thomas's payday is coming and he's not going to like it. This is going to be good. Yeah, I completely understand where you're coming from when it comes to Thomas. All kinds of new stuff coming out this week. So buckle up. Make sure you're subscribed. Thanks for watching. Bye.